Thank you. Feedback is more than just recognizing achievements or goals achieved. It's part of and very important part of clear communication. And who else than Toastmasters here knows the importance of clear communication? Now there are three important goals of any feedback or evaluation. One, to give listener clear tools and means to achieve and keep him or her on the course which he is or she is supposed to be achieved. So provide the tools and means to keep on the course. That's the first goal. Second goal is to give clear cut, clear idea what they achieved so far and most importantly give them, appraise them, give them appraise what, what is required. That's in kind of acknowledgement or encouragement. And third important part of giving feedback to, to promote them or encourage them to improve on the given areas where they, they, require the, they require the corrections or the improvements. So three areas. First thing, giving the tools and the means to stay on the course. Second thing, acknowledge and encourage. And third one, suggest the improvements in, in form of the appraise and the encouragement. And how you achieve that one? So to achieve that, you have There are four points which are important and important aspects. Share information, not advice. Who likes advice here? <laughs> Nobody. <laughs> so it should be in form of the sharing information. So you talk about the information points and that should inform or infer into action points. So never advice. Keep it brief and I have trouble with that. Keep it concise. Somewhere I heard that more than three critical points or improvements, that means it's all about your improvement. You shouldn't be going more than three improvements in any given feedback. Accentuate the positive and that's very important. And just not the correction points or improvement, you should also give the listener points to stay, keep, maintain those positive points what he or she has maintained throughout the part. And the last, Timeliness. If you don't wait for the end of session the way I waited end of year, you should have the communication which is a frequent, maybe quarterly or so. And praise the progress. Everybody likes the praise if it comes timely and with the information. Now, going back to unit to recent topic, so I'm going to the second session. Uh, actual, actual feedback of the short yeah. okay. Fellow Toastmasters and guests, who knows the person called Bill Gates? Almost everybody. He's a founder of one of the topest technology company, Microsoft, billionaire, one of the richest person in the world, and he always said, you should have somebody to give you feedback. And the main reason is, that's how you improve. If you get the feedback, that's one of the tools you can use for improvement. And when we look at the performance of the feedback, so the performance of our Toastmaster Club, I'm here today in front of you to give that important, perform that important role, giving the feedback. <coughs> Now for the 2013 and 14, Toastmaster International gave, gave us a goal that was 
three to four minutes. Okay, there is some. So, Toastmaster International gave us a goal in form of Distinguished Club Program, DC. And if you don't know about this program, there are total nine goals to meet to become a president distinguished and year before we were on that, that path. But this year we met six of six of those goals. And if we have got that's why we, we got at the distinguished level. If we have met one more goal, we could have reached to that select distinguished level. And two more which would have taken us to the president distinguished goal. And just to give the more information about what we achieved. This is the chart which I copied from Toastmaster International website. And if you see here, there are the multiple activities which we can achieve. And there is a quantity. And the third part is basically how much we achieved. So we already achieved, there are the tick marks, so we already achieved advanced communication communicator. So we have won one of that. Leadership awards, we have believe we have two CCs, so we already achieved that one. We got seven new members, so we achieved already one four members target and second member target, we are just short of one member. And nine club officers are trained, so four was required. We had six officers we got trained. And membership renewal was on time and club officers list was on time. So where we missed basically, there are a couple of ideas we could have improved. We have no CCs in this board wow. yet. And the requirement was at least two CCs to get to one point, which, which would have got us to the select distinguished. And another point to get another two CCs would have given another point. Next one, where we could improve. One more advanced communication bronze, advanced communication silver, or advanced leadership bronze silver would have given us take one point. We could improve there. And last one, one member. Wow. <laughs> one member, we just missed that select distinguished because of one member. So having that one member added, we could have achieved it. So these are the three areas basically we need to improve. Other than that, that we are, I think we are on track to get the CCLs. Nice job on there. Officers are getting trained. That's a nice, nice sign. And uh, yeah, the getting new members is also good. Seven members is not, not a bad one here. Now there are these are the Toastmaster International goals. These are the properly measurable. But there are non-measurable goals or aspects which I thought are important to recognize. And I thought as a club, this is the most important part which I see in day in, day out basis. We are care, careful, care, caring and supportive. It's a caring and supportive environment. We care about the club's progress. We care about other members. And throughout the meetings or the events, we see is support, great support for the improving, achieving the goals. So that's a great job there. Volunteerism. And it's not easy to achieve, but you might have seen, whenever there is a slot open or the person doesn't show up, we have always hands up and then we say that I, I can take that. So that voluntarism is great. That's again a part of our culture. So great job guys. We have to keep it there. Discipline and procedures. Compared to other clubs, I think we are better on the procedures. Thankfully, we have senior members, secretarial, who keep us on track. John tries his best. And procedures. There are some parts which we can improve. Those are minor parts, especially something like a discipline, not getting up while somebody is speaking here on the lectern. Those are very small parts. But overall, I'll say comparatively, we are better on the discipline and the procedure part. And last one, very important, overall positive culture. I think once you come into this room, I think all these sad faces at least get a lot of chances to smile and feel that positive that energy. So great job there. These are our strengths of our club and I wish we should keep continuing. We should concentrate on our those small, small areas where we could have done a little better and then achieved a precedent distribution. But overall, I think we did a great job 
and this feedback might help us next year to achieve and concentrate on those goals where we missed it. So, thank you for giving me opportunity to speak and also the opportunity to be a president for one whole year. Thank you. Back to